Welcome to Tesla Info, and today we are going to talk about free supercharging. We will show you how to find out if a car has it, and whether it transfers to a new owner. First, a little history. When Tesla first launched the Model S that included free, unlimited supercharging with all but the smallest capacity cars. In late 2016, Tesla decided that this offer was no longer sustainable and changed the scheme. Although the transition over January to April 2017 was more complicated than this, the new scheme effectively gave free supercharging to the first owner when a referral code was used. Eventually, Tesla also stopped this unlimited free supercharging scheme and switched to a free supercharging mileage allocation for each referral, both for the buyer and the person making the referral. This scheme has now also stopped. In addition, Tesla have also offered free supercharging for a period of time. The most notable use of this scheme was when Tesla offered a year's free supercharging to buyers who took delivery at the end of 2020. While in general Tesla no longer offer free supercharging, occasionally they will offer cars with free supercharging as a sales incentive. How to tell if a car has free supercharging and whether it will transfer the most accurate way is to examine the Tesla configuration codes for a car. To check, visit My Tesla, select Manage Car, and then select the link to the car image. You may need to right-click on the image to bring up the option. Drop this link into the option decoder on Tesla Info, and we will do the hard work for you. Tesla use four different option codes to describe the different schemes they offer. The only free supercharging scheme that will transfer to a new owner is SC01. If you do not have access to My Tesla, then a slightly less reliable way is to examine the charging screen in the car. On this screen, it will detail the last supercharging session. If it displays a price, including a zero value price, then the car does not have transferable free unlimited supercharging. If the car says there was no recent supercharging, then it is highly likely the car has transferable free supercharging. The one exception is when the car genuinely has not been supercharged. When buying a car from a dealer, if free supercharging is an important feature then get the dealer to give a written guarantee the car has it. If buying privately then ask the existing owner to show the configuration codes in my Tesla as described previously.